Well, in less than 24 hours from now, the organization Save Nigeria Group will be holding a protest march in Abuja to protest against the long absence of the president and demand that he hands over power to the vice president. The group says the march will cover a distance of about three kilometers and terminate at the National Assembly, where a letter will be passed to the leadership of the Assembly. Now, uh, let's put all of this into a bit of perspective. Deji, you've been monitoring the issues going on and the developments. Just bring us up to speed with um, what we can expect tomorrow. Well, thank you very much, IJ. Now, if this planned rally goes ahead tomorrow, it would be the first time some Nigerians would be pouring out onto the streets. Now, not the street anywhere, but we're talking about the streets of the federal capital territory, Abuja, in protest over the long absence of the president. And I tell you that is not going to be funny at all. The march would coincide with the resumption of the National Assembly, which has been on recess since late last year. It would also be coming at a time when both houses appear to be bowing to public pressure to debate the long absence of the president. We will not be able to say what the resolution of the House will be, but I know that there are matters for us to discuss that on the floor of the House. Whatever the nature of that debate, the proposed march would only increase the pressure on the lawmakers over this issue.